Hello friends, in my this video, I am going to discuss about piezoelectric accelerometer. Okay, you all know what is accelerometer, that is some sensor which can measure acceleration. Okay, and what is piezoelectric property also you know from my previous video. Basically, piezoelectricity is the property of certain crystal of generating a voltage when subjected to pressure or some force. Okay, that means uh, if some if uh, we apply some force on a crystal, if it produces some voltage, then that is called piezoelectric effect. Why uh, some crystals shows this property? I have already explained in my previous video. I will give you the uh, link in the description. So from there you can check my that video. Okay. Now in this video we will discuss how this effect can help us in detail in the, in the uh, calculation of the acceleration or in determining the acceleration okay so let us discuss see this is the simple diagram of piezoelectric accelerometer here the piezoelectric crystal is placed here one mass m is attached with a spring with this wall of the box and the mass is in contact with the crystal and what we have done we have connected one voltmeter with the crystal to measure the voltage produced by this crystal when some force is applied on it. Okay. Now suppose we apply some force on the box in this direction. So we know that is F is equal to M A. Clear? Or in vector form F vector is equal to M A vector. So basically the direction of force is the direction of acceleration. Okay. So as we are applying the force in this direction, so the box will accelerate in this direction. So as a result, what will happen? See, the mass is inside the box. So obviously on the mass in this direction, one force will be applied and that is called pseudo force. That thing you know from your basic concept in physics. So because of the pseudo force, the mass will get one acceleration in this direction. But see, the mass is in contact with the crystal. So as a result, mass will give mass will give one force on this crystal, and the spring will somehow elongate if the mass moves in this direction. So force will be applied on the crystal. So as a result, voltage will produce in the crystal because this is piezoelectric crystal, and we know for piezoelectric crystal, voltage is produced when force is applied. So now initially the voltmeter uh, needle was in its null position but when the force is applied then obviously it will deflect and it will show us some particular value so suppose the final structure is this one what is just difference see the spring is elongated when we uh, accelerate the whole box in this direction because of the pseudo force the mass the attached mass with the spring want to go to this direction so as a result the spring elongates and due to the pseudo force, ma the mass applies one force on the piezoelectric crystal. As a result, the crystal produces one voltage. So see, the now the needle of the voltmeter is deflected from its null position and it is showing some voltage value. Clear? By measuring the voltage, we can get an idea that how much force is applied on the crystal and the force is basically due to the pseudo force which is created due to the acceleration of the box. So from the from the measurement of the voltage uh, which is created by the crystal, we can get an idea of the acceleration in which the box, the whole box is accelerated in this direction. Okay. In this way, piezoelectric accelerometer works. I hope the concept is clear to you. If you have any doubt, you can ask in comment section and for and for more videos related to sensors and electronics and communication engineering. You can subscribe my channel and don't forget to press the bell icon. Thank you for watching.